welcome. My name is David Jeffrey, and I tutor in chemistry and organic chemistry for Wisean. So a student has asked the question, um, asked a question about the neutralization reaction between sulfuric acid and potassium hydroxide. And they've given, um, I think you can see for yourself, they've given some uh, quantities and concentrations um, when the two solutions are mixed together. And the problem is to find the concentration of uh, unreacted sulfuric acid. And so I've set this up here for you. And of course, the first thing, the first thing to do in any, in any uh, chemistry problem is to write out a uh, proper, complete and valid and balanced chemical reaction equation. Now I have left out the phases because I was told I can, right? But this of course is uh, aqueous sulfuric acid, reacts with two mole equivalents. One mole equivalent of sulfuric acid reacts with two mole equivalents of potassium hydroxide. It's a one to two ratio. Why? Because sulfuric acid is a diprotic acid, right? That's, that's where the one to two ratio uh, comes in here. And what you're left with, um, of course, is the salt from a neutralization reaction, uh, potassium sulfate in this, core, in this case, and two mole equivalents of water for the diprotic acid, the complete neutralization of the diprotic acid. Then what I've done here is I've set up, right, volume times molarity equals moles. So it looks like we're dealing with 0.125 moles of sulfuric acid originally and 0 0.048 moles of potassium hydroxide originally. Well, 0 0.048 moles of potassium hydroxide will only neutralize half that mole quantity of sulfuric based on the stoichiometry of the balanced reaction or 0.024 moles of sulfuric acid, which means that if we start with 0.125 and we only react 0.024, we're gonna have 0.101 moles remaining, but that's not the final answer because we need to find the concentration. So to find the concentration, um, let's see, I'll do that over here and I'll type it. Right, to find the concentration, what's what's molarity? Well, it's moles, 0 0.101 moles, right, per volume. Well, the volume is 0.25 liters plus 0.2, I'm sorry, 0.25 plus 0.2, divided by 0 0.450 liters. And so what is that equal to? We get our now we get our calculator, right? As the last thing that we do. Um 0.101 divided by 0.45 is equal to the three significant figures 0.224. It's 0 0.2, whoops, 24. 0.224 molar sulfuric acid is the remaining concentration um, following neutralization, okay? That's it, hope that helps and hope to see some of you in my tutoring room in YSAN.